G'day from Australia, it's Wendy here for Blue Moon Scrapbooking. In this video I'm going to show you this really uh, fun, easy project to do create with these um, gorgeous basic grey papers, um, just little notebooks and um, yeah I've used this um, range of basic grey papers um, and these wonderful thick stickers and of course the alphabets. I used pre-cut white, uh, standard white paper and some thread. The tools I've used are paper trimmers, bone scorer, lovely bone scorer and uh, corner round. This paper is um, the cover of my little booklet. It's roughly 6 inches by 8 inches, and uh, which is uh, quite handy. You can get two out of a sheet of uh, 12 by 12 and still have a nice big strip left. This pre-cut paper is just half of your standard um, letter size paper. I've got a bundle of about six or eight and just folding them in half. I use my um, paper trimmer because it's got a little ledge at the bottom there and just helps me line up the uh, edges um, perfectly without too much effort. Always score my folds with my bone scorer. Did I say I love my bone folder? I love my bone folder. So I'm just folding the cover in half as well and creasing that with the bone folder as well. Just assemble the booklet with the pages inside, line that up nicely and just to help us while we're sewing I um, just grab some fold back clips and use them to, to help keep it nice and neat. Just use the, the fold back clips to, to help keep everything in place while we sew. Alright, warning, bad for film camera use here. Um, on my sewing machine, I've just centred the needle and give it a fairly long uh, stitch length. Otherwise, you can actually just perforate the paper if the stitches are too close together. I've lined up the, the scored line with my needle and the guide on my foot. Don't stress too much about tensions and and other things on your sewing machine just as long as you don't use your needle again for fabric there's really not too many ways that you can go wrong just go nice and slow because you want to follow that score line um, but uh, yeah it's really dead easy if you've never used your sewing machine on paper before you really should have a go it's fun I'm ready to trim off this um, paper that's just poking out the side. Just line up your paper trimmer with the uh, edge of the cover and um, trim away. So you can leave it like that or you can do what I'm going to do and what I did on this sample is just round the uh, the corners. Um, if you have got a strong corner rounder you could do the whole booklet easily. Uh, mine only handles a few sheets at a time. Thank you. 
Now to add a little decorative touch using a strip of this gorgeous uh, basic grey paper. Now I'm just going to use one of these so cute basic grey stamps and um, decorate the front page and um, use a smaller stamp for each of the other pages. Lots and lots of ways to decorate these books. I've used a bit of um, ribbon on this book. Hope you're inspired to have a go, and um, thanks for watching.